has modeled any lesson that I feel um, not very comfortable with doing. She came in and modeled for me so I could take some good notes and go off of those. Um, she has also come in and uh, watched me do a lesson so that I could see how well my kids were engaged and how many turn and talks I had. And then I was able to follow up with, um, with her after that to see how that went. Having so, her come in and demonstrate um, certain teaching practices to um, for me with my students so that I could have a visual and a model to see how that's done and also she's come in and observed me as I try to put that model and model it myself and put it into practice and I've been able to get feedback from her from doing that. I've utilized my coach um, by having her come in and model a lesson um, so that I can have a refresher on what we're doing. Um, I've also had her come in and observe some student behaviors and give me some suggestions, um, some feedback about different student behaviors or um, just different kinds of and sometimes they can minimize the workload for you because they're able to cut out some of the stuff that maybe you don't need to focus on as much and you can focus on the more um, helpful material and work from there. I um, was looking at my goals and I really needed to figure out what did I want to do for a personal goal this year. I needed help figuring out what should it look like. Um, I had gotten the piece where I kind of knew what I wanted to do, but I just wasn't quite sure how to pinpoint it, how to state the goal, and Erin helped me walk through those steps and kind of helped me visualize what that would look like. writing goal and one way that she helped us was being a second grade teacher herself. She had a lot of background knowledge but she was also able to um, converse with other second grade teachers throughout the district and come back and share their best practices and strategies that they use um, for their goals or just within their classrooms. Assessments, things like that so that I can adjust my instruction accordingly. Um, she's also come in and helped me out with our team PLCs and looking at student data there and looking at samples um, and how to um, use a PLC to, to make it more focused on student learning. Then, um, as far as grade level work for PLCs, um, our coach came in and answered any questions that we needed clarification with. Um, we struggled with some rubrics and she was able to come in and show us some tips on how we can grade as um, grade our students as a grade level. Worked with Erin this year through PLCs at the beginning of the year. She helped us with getting our writing goal started and looking at student data. And she also helped me implement some fun technology in the classroom like Shadow Puppet, which has really engaged my students more. In um, also, just being able to bounce ideas off of someone if I'm struggling, like I was struggling a little bit with classroom management this year and so being able to get some ideas um, from a coach to say, hey, what about this or try this um, and that's impacted how I teach in my room and how um, I manage my students. Um, provide valuable resources with all the Steve Dunn writing instruction. That was the most powerful piece for me Great this level. year. And Erin helped me um, go through the pacing guide. If I had any questions, I would email her. She would find the videos for me or um, provide some anchor charts. So just going through the pacing guide, and if I had any questions, um, she helped me out with that. Video. Classroom as much as possible. Anytime you're unsure of a lesson or um, are looking at the pacing guide and you're a little bit confused, have the coach come in, walk you through the program, walk you through whatever it is that you're questioning, what you're unsure of. Uh, have them model in your classroom, have them do a lesson. That, oh, if I could just give one piece of advice, I would, I would say do not think that any question is a dumb question. Um, they are there to help with whatever, so even if you feel like you should know something and you don't, always ask because they give great feedback and um, just great advice and they love hearing those questions.